No longer do companies and organizations operate in a vacuum, and they need to also identify their role in creating change in the industry. In this episode of The Update, I talk with Taman George, co-founder and CEO of Creative Theory Agency, about why diversity and representation are the keys to brand success. I think we should start with the basics, uh, really at the foundational level of what diversity means to you and why you think it's so important, especially right now in marketing. Diversity in its simplest form is really representation. The world as we see it is incredibly nuanced, uh, people, age, race, gender, identity. And we ultimately think that marketing should really be more representative and thoughtful about that. And so when we think about the next levels of diversity, it's how do we give equal opportunity and show equity for all the nuance that exists in the population that we we market to. I think in light of recent calls for racial justice, how do you think the definition of diversity has changed or expanded for consumers and brands alike? The definition of diversity, I don't think has changed all that much. I think there's lots of agencies and companies like ours who have been doing this work for a number of years, but what we really are seeing a difference in is the urgency and top level support that a lot of these ideas and initiatives are gaining right now, which is absolutely necessary. I think consumers are forcing brands to evaluate uh, their position in systemic inequality, rightfully so. So, Taman, it's commonly understood why diversity is so important for societal value. But how does diversity drive business value? I think a lot of what we're seeing today is that diverse companies, especially diverse agencies, are better equipped to solve really complex business problems. I think if you're not making really big decisions with uh, more representation at the table, age, race, gender, identity, you're often going to be missing out on really big pieces of ideas that should have been there in the first place. Creative Theory has been one of those partners to Google uh, for a number of years. Uh, Can you share some examples of insights that your team brought to Google, how you were able to execute campaigns in a way that was true and authentic to our brand? Yeah. So most recently, we were able to work on the black owned business attribute. And so we knew just from our general circle that there is an increased demand for how can people support black owned business in this exact moment. So the real the real victory there was that Google was able to be incredibly helpful at a time where we knew that black owned bi- searches for black owned business were growing exponentially and being able to kind of service um, uh, that need was really essential. What do you say to brands who struggle to find their multicultural voice in this moment or feel that they don't have anything to add? They just don't have that that value proposition. Uh, what, what can they do? The first thing is, is that you have to earn the right to add to the conversation. Um, we see all the times brands are hesitant uh, or unsure how to kind of enter the conversation and and simply it can often start with your internal employees, but then there are very small um, external things that they can do, such as partnering with different organizations, finding ways to support uh, different missions that align with their business values as well. And that is kind of your first introduction into really being a big part uh, of this anti-racism movement. 